We're here at Suzy Art in Braintree, Massachusetts. And um, they just picked up a LEP 6000 printer. And as you know, in the DTF world, it is um, inarguable and unarguable that this is, for the price point, the best DTF printer in America because, as I've told you all so many times, is that um, no matter where you are with these printers, is that any technician who's an Epson tech can stop by and repair the printer. Um, very simple to set up, you know, and you should have no problems with this. Of course, I say that, but then, you know, most people do start having problems. So that's, you know, part of DTF. I tell everybody DTF is like living with your ex-wife and nobody wants to ever believe me until they start uh, printing. And then we're going to um, go share this in another group. And then we'll talk about something here in just a second that most of you don't um, understand or realize yet. So let's just do DTF. All right, so um, I've done a like a black knockout on this and some different things in CAD link. And that's what we're using right now. Our ink assignment for CAD link. We're looking at, um, let's see, what do we see? C, C yellow, white, black, magenta, white, white, white. And you can see readily that um, for images that are you know, 10 or 11 inches in, in uh, width, like this circle that I'm printing, you know, the speed by which it's done, it's two and a half to three times faster than a um, Epson P800. The rip makes it uh, somewhat more encouraging and, um, you know, to get your prints done. But if you're somewhere in America and you have a bunch of prints that you need to get done that are full color, then this is the way to do it. And although, as I told you, what sets the value of a DTF printer, <coughs> what sets the value of a DTF printer is number of nozzles and number of channels. So these are 360 nozzles, eight channels, very fast printer. If you guys are in the Braintree, Boston area, you can go to Suzy Art and order some transfers. Reach out to the company. Let's get some transfers done through them if you're in this area or anywhere on the east coast and you need transfers done the same day this is the way to do it we're going to take a look here in just a second at the print and i just want to make sure that we get a cut on it once it's done all right and we're just going to come right over here Let's see how long this one will take to get going Junior, where can you get DTF inks at? You can go to this website right there and buy your DTF inks. You can uh, head on over to our friends over at STS Inks. Of course, they're gonna charge you more than my site will. Um, you can go to our friends over to DTG Pro. They sell ink and um, those are about the two places I think that I would be comfortable sending you all to get ink. Vibrant white. And now you can see why um, this is one of the best printers in America. But it doesn't come without its heartache. <coughs> I tell people all the time, <coughs> all the time I'm having allergy attacks. I tell people all the time that DTF printing is like living with your ex-wife or ex-husband who took you to court. You know, it's a very, very, very 
mental consuming job, but the rewards are great. Junior says, tell me a little bit about the Epson 1430. <coughs> so the Epson 1430, many screen printers use that 1430 to build their screen positives. Um, I had a drink somewhere that I put down. And it's a good printer. Uh, what is that printer? A six channel printer? Yours downstairs, it's six. Yeah. It's six channels, 180 nozzles. So thus it is a little bit slow. And, um, but you, you know, you can definitely manage. So I'm gonna set this right here and just let it print. Unlike <coughs> Acro Rip, which has a built-in cutter for the paper, this does not. And it gives you a time frame. These are very big logos. They're printed at uh, the maximum resolution that CAD Link can print at. So Junior says he's converting the printer. You got a little bit of work to do with that thing, but it's not impossible. And I'm gonna finish right here, let them update over there. And then uh, this this right here, that little neat spot is from, yeah, from the roller. It'll go away though. I'd still wear it. Just like the one downstairs, it's like sometimes on the roller. Oh yeah, right. Well, this doesn't do that. It's just, I've got to, you know, I didn't have my scissors near me or anything. The struggles is setting a shop up to DTF print. Everybody's losing weight. I go home. <coughs> we'll put it to tonight when the sun's down. Take this on the heat press, go press it on an old shirt and see what it does. And uh, we'll work on the image to get a better quality image on it. Not how it's like The is at 370, is that okay? 325. Yeah. You gotta let that cool down a second. How do you tell when you have a good transfer? The, you can go to peel it and you can see that this is not really coming off. Um, so that would be ready to hit and press. And we're just going to work through some of the art issues once I get a better image.
You don't need to cure your transfers that long, everyone, if you're using something like a conveyor dryer. It's only the heat press method that you have to let that thing sit there for a while. <clears throat> you know, once you get your proper setup with the right dryer, you know, you're, you're hauling ass. going to send off another print. So they're gonna log on to this and then get you set up because I really have no idea what Catlink did on my computer. Um, What's time when I press it? 15 seconds, you wanna go down there and do it? The uh, press is cool enough. All right, but... so. Again, everybody, looking at the different printers in, in the United States that are available are the Asian two, three, four head printers. For $7,950, there's the STS printer, which is the Muto Value Jet mm -hmm. 628, 180 nozzles, eight channels, $7,500. And we're printing it. double that speed as currently through this. So we hope that you continue to keep an eyeball on our website, live event printing. If you are in Braintree or Boston and you need transfers, stop by our friends at Suzy Art. They'd be happy to print you some transfers or some t-shirts locally. And um, you know, if you want to get a bunch of screen printing done, take a look at this beautiful shop. They've got you covered. Right here in Braintree, Massachusetts, they can knock out, you know, five, six hundred shirts in a day, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Easily, easily. You got it. So it's a great shop right here. Check it out, everybody, one more time. Susie Art, that's right here in Braintree, Massachusetts, 781-817-6561. Call them up and tell them you'd like some transfers. They'd be happy to print transfers for you, right? Yeah, yeah, I know it. All right, man. So long, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for letting me go live in the store, everybody. Thank you. Yeah, very welcome. Susie Art Susie here Art. in Braintree, Mass. And, of course, we don't have everybody here, but it is what it is. <laughs>